make these ecological puppets. Uh, you probably realise by now that uh, our puppet show is going to be Three Little Pigs, a version of it, our own version. And I've started off by coating the uh, puppet head in an ecological white paint. Uh, this one is actually the stunt puppet. I'm going to use him to try out some methods because in the past I've always used things like glue sticks uh, which obviously you can get them in ecological but I can't get them here. Uh, so I'm going to have to make my own glue and I'm going to have to do some tests. And so I've made uh, this little stunt puppet so I can use him just to test out so I don't uh, if it goes wrong, it'll be okay. I've, I want to make as well, I want to make three pigs that are completely different. Um, I'm going to have biodiversity. And this one's going to be a Tamworth pig. And uh, in order to enhance the, the beautiful red colour you get on the Tamworth, um, I've given him an undercoat of, um, of water paint, base paint. Uh, this one, he's going to be the Mangalitz, or rather the uh, Lincolnshire curly coat. I'm going to have to give him a slight uh, darker colour around here and then he's going to have the, the typical whiskers and curly uh, hair and this other one is going to be a Gloucester old spot. I might do him with velvet, I'm not sure, I've got some very old, nice old 1920s velvet which I could cut patches out but I'll see how my glue will work. Uh, the glue I'm going to use is going to be based on gelatine and vinegar, that's it. This is really simple glue and I got the recipe from a channel, a really useful channel called colourful canary and I'll put the link down for that and I'm going to create the pig fur uh, by using some insulation material that we've got because um, we we're going to build our house uh, an eco house and we're just looking at um, insulation materials my sister sent me this this is gorgeous stuff it's uh, organic uh, undyed sheep's wool which is a beautiful insulation material um, and I'm going to try and use that to make the, the, the pig fur. And then the other one is one that uh, we've used here uh, for seating. Again, it's an insulation material. I'll show you it. Looks like that. It's fabulous stuff. And it's hemp. And I've used it, as I say, to do upholstery so far. But that will make some, um, a gorgeous colour for the Tamworth pig. And these are some of the sets I've made so far. Uh, they're going to be lowered down um, in front of the stage. And this one is uh, made out of terracotta clay. I just pressed this down onto... Um, I, I made some forms, some shapes of bricks in cardboard and then just pressed them down. And Andy insisted that I laid them correctly. Then this house is made out of pallet wood and it's supposed to have a recycled uh, leaded light, uh, we use those in our house, so I thought they would choose them in the pig house. And I sort of um, experimented with just using a tissue paper and some coloured paper. I, I coloured the paper and then I put coconut oil on it just to give it a, a, uh, a stained glass window look. And for the uh, roof, I've thatched the roof. This is organic lucerne hay. Uh, we get it for our chicken's nest boxes and I've just made it into... Um, something that looks hopefully like thatch. This is the straw house and that was a bit difficult to start with because to try and make a straw bale in, in a small uh, miniature design is quite difficult but I used for the ends, I, we just had uh, the remainders of what we'd used to insulate our walls here which is hemp, chopped hemp, so I used that for the end of the bales. I tied the mock bales up with uh, single strands of organic lucerne hay and then these are just organic straw. And these are going to be for the pigs' costumes. And these are some organic fabrics that uh, I have some remnants. This is gorgeous. It's actually organic yak from Nepal. And it's mixed with an organic hemp. It's a beautiful fabric to work with. And then I've got uh, percal cotton here. Uh, again organic and an organic mix here of cotton and linen and then this is Berber cotton again organic so I've got all these that I'm ready to work with Mr Piggy's gonna have some new clothes soon Ooh.